Skin cancer is on the rise in our country and especially here in Arizona. After all, we do live in the Valley of the Sun. The good news is you can prevent it. And if you are diagnosed with it, there's something you can do about it. I am with brothers and board certified dermatologists, Dathan and Karsten Hammond of Saguaro Dermatology. And first of all, gentlemen, thank you for having me over. We're so happy to have you. Yes, I'm excited because we're yeah, all gonna welcome. learn something, right? All right, let's talk about, first of all, the importance of screening. A lot of people don't put it high on the priority list, but they should. Surely, uh, I mean, skin cancers are exceedingly common. Uh, the most common type of cancer in the United States is skin cancer, actually. Wow. Yeah, um, one in five Americans eventually develops one. And the most important risk factor is how early it's detected. And here's what's crazy is it can go, it can grow anywhere, right? Not yeah. just in exposed to the sun areas, right? Absolutely. On our body. Absolutely. So that yearly skin check is an opportunity for your dermatologist to look over your whole skin and hopefully find things as early as possible. Okay. Early detection really, really is key. All right. Let's talk about the importance of seeing a board certified dermatologist. Why does that matter? So these days, there's a lot of different people out there that are passionate about skin care and the skin and they may have a lot of good advice for cosmetics or other routines, but when it comes to skin cancer, you definitely want the benefit of seeing a person who has had modern training, not just passion and experience. And so board certification by the American Board of Dermatology is what you should be looking for. Oh, okay, excellent advice. All right, let's talk about skin cancer and some of the telltale signs to look for. I wanna take a look at this particular skin cancer. This is a melanoma. Uh, this is a patient of yours uh, exactly. that you treated. So mm -hmm. what are the telltale signs? Yeah, so this is what's called a malignant melanoma, the most dangerous type of skin cancer. Generally speaking, we have a, a rule called the ABCDE rule. And this is something that your viewers can even do at home. The rules are A for asymmetry, B for border, C for color, D for diameter, so larger than the head of a pencil eraser, and then E is for evolving or changing over time. Okay, all and, right. And if you have a spot that you know fulfills any of those criteria, definitely worth getting it checked out by a dermatologist. Yeah, absolutely. Now, this is a different type of skin cancer. This is called basal. Yeah, so this is a basal cell skin cancer. Okay. Okay. This is the most common type of skin cancer, actually. Uh, these typically show up as like a red bump or a spot that you thought was a pimple or a spot that's not going away, not healing. If you have a pimple that you've had for three, four, five months, you should probably get it checked. It might not be a pimple. Yeah, yeah. Well, actually, you were telling me earlier, both of you, that if you have any concerns at all, you should have it checked, right? It's always a good idea to get suspicious spots checked. It's no problem for us to be able to reassure you about a spot. A lot of people come in and if we tell them it's it's fine, they're they're embarrassed. But peace of mind's really worth it. Oh, absolutely. If nine times out of 10, it turns out to be nothing, it's worth it for that one time out of 10, we catch something early. Absolutely. Let's talk about the fact that you can actually treat it right here in the office, right? How does that work? Yeah, that's right. So most early skin cancers have very high cure rates as long as we can, can identify them early and pick the correct surgery. And many of those procedures we can safely do in the office right here. And that means that not only are you avoiding the risk and the cost of the hospital, but we can we can take care of you right in, in an office setting like this. Yeah, I mean, surgery is a big word, <laughs> you know, but it's really not like, it's something you can do. It, it is a surgical procedure, but very mm -hmm. quick and, and minimally invasive, correct? Most surgeries for skin cancers are what are called an excision, where we just cut out the area of the skin cancer, just under local anesthesia, so there's no tube down your throat. We put on some nice music, it takes about 20 minutes. So we have patients who sometimes nap during the procedure. Very straightforward. Okay, that's good to know. Let's talk about prevention. Sunscreen, does it really matter? Absolutely. I mean, the most important risk factor for, sun, for skin cancer is UV exposure. Right. And so the best way to prevent that, you know, firstly is sun avoidance. So yeah. hard you know, to do here in Arizona, right? <laughs> yeah, but we recommend, you know, if you want to be an active person, the best time is not between 10 and three. Okay. The best time is, you know, Twilight time, that's when you should get your run in. Okay. Um, but if you are outside, sunscreen it certainly will decrease your risk of developing a skin cancer over time. Excellent. Gosh, I've learned so much from you guys today. Thank you so much. We're so happy to have you. Yeah, we Thanks appreciate for that. By. Absolutely. And here is a special offer. Become a new patient and new patients will pay just $50 for a skin cancer screening. Sawara Dermatology has two locations to choose from, one in Phoenix, one in Mesa. Give them a call at 480-780-3815 or visit the website saworoderm.com.